When it comes to being a big time gamer, you want to be able to have the most highly detailed and absolutely realistic textures from your game's highest ultra settings. Or, for those that are in the graphic design and artistic workspace, you might need to render massive 3D models and videos without any lag time and get that project to your boss ASAP. Well, the best way to be able to solve both these problems is through the use of a GPU that can handle even your most demanding needs. Which is why today we're going to be going over the top 3 most popular graphics cards from both Nvidia and AMD to be able to give your gaming sessions that extra boost they need or for your workflow to have that extra oomph for production. Kicking off our list of the most popular graphics cards, we're coming in with the latest from NVIDIA, the GeForce RTX 3090. Right off the bat from NVIDIA is their all new GeForce RTX 3090, which has proven to be their best iteration of graphics cards yet, and for good reason. NVIDIA's newest flagship GPU boasts a whopping 24 gigabytes of GDDR6X RAM tucked behind that huge heatsink and it delivers when it comes to hardcore gaming and 3D rendering. In fact, it has since replaced the manufacturer's two highest performing graphics cards of the previous generation, the NVIDIA Titan RTX and the RTX 2080 Ti. Not to mention that you're going to be getting 384-bit memory interface and 10,500 CUDA cores, practically making the 3090 like having two, if not three, graphics cards in one. And being that it's already got a core boost clock of 1785 MHz, plus the chance to be able to boost over 2000 MHz, you can be rest assured that every game or every program will be running smooth like butter. And speaking of running smooth like butter, even with the newest AAA game titles, the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3090 delivers amazing 4K performance and can even handle 8K gaming at 60fps. And even if you got some games from years ago that weren't originally built with 4K or 8K graphics in mind, then you're still going to be getting massive boosts in graphic quality by letting you bump up those games to ultra or max settings without the card ever breaking a sweat. Even with some of the newer titles that I was able to play on this thing like Assassin's Creed Valhalla, Shadow of the Tomb Raider, GTA 5, and The Witcher 3, they all ran super smooth without breaking a sweat. Not to mention that it is an absolute blessing to those who need some heavy graphic lifting for 3D animation and video rendering because even 10 minute YouTube videos like this one were able to be completely rendered and formatted in minutes instead of hours like older graphics cards. And don't worry about overheating ever again, as the RTX 3090 comes with three Torx fans 4.0s, which are built together with a linked outer ring design that focuses airflow into the updated Tri-Froze R2 cooling system. Plus, the integrated core pipes are precision machined for maximum contact over the GPU and helps to spread the heat along the full length of the heatsink for optimal cooling and dispersion of the heat. By the way, today's sponsor is Total AV. Total AV is consistently the top choice to protect all of your household devices, computers, laptops, and smartphones from any sort of viruses, malware, and hackers. You can check the description of our full review along with an exclusive 80% discount if you're interested. Coming up next in the most popular graphics cards, we have the Radeon RX 580. The RX 580 series graphics card features the latest Polaris architecture, which includes the 4th gen GCN graphics cores, a brand new display engine, new multimedia cores, all on the revolutionary Next Infinite 14 processor technology for enhanced performance and efficiency, meaning that pretty much no matter what game or program you throw at it, this bad boy can handle it all. Also, AMD's Radeon RX 580 is one of the best graphics cards for PC gaming right now, that is if you're balling on a budget thanks to its excellent 1080p gaming performance and low price point. Compared to the most popular GTX 1060 6GB, it's more often than not faster and less expensive, giving the opportunity to still have the chance to play newer titles, but without having to shell out an arm and a leg to get that smooth playing performance. In terms of the RX 580's guts, you're going to find a solid 2,304 cores of GPU power, along with an impressive boost clock that will get you up to 1,545 MHz of power. Not to mention that there is a jaw-dropping 6.1 teraflops and 8 gigabytes of memory that's going to seriously give you that competitive edge in the gaming space. And with a full-blown 256 gigabytes of memory bandwidth, you can watch games and programs boot up in no time and continue to run without any sort of hitches. Plus, you can forget about overheating and having your area smell like burning plastic because the RX 580 comes equipped with XFX double dispersion cooling technology for optimal cooling and performance, allowing you to game or work for hours on end without worrying that something's going to blow up halfway through your session. 
Oh, and something that I cannot forget to mention is that the RX 580 is AMD VR ready, letting you experience the newest generation of compelling virtual content with the Radeon RX GTS graphics card paired with the leading VR headsets. The Radeon RX GTS graphics card coupled with AMD's Liquid VR technology helps to deliver a virtually stutter-free low latency experience, which is essential for remarkable virtual reality environments. Last and certainly not least, we got the GeForce RTX 3070. The building blocks for the world's fastest, most efficient GPU is here, with all new Amphir SM that brings two times the FPS through improved power efficiency. Not only that, but you're going to be able to get high end detail and speed thanks to the integrated 8GB of GDDR6 RAM and 256 bit memory interface, along with getting a boost clock that'll go up to 1.73 GHz meaning that you'll be able to run all of your games and programs at high settings and not have any hiccups. Get up to two times the thoroughput with structural sparsity and advanced AI algorithms such as DLSS, which supports games and monitors up to 8K resolutions, along with cores that deliver a massive boost in game performance and all new AI capabilities. No matter what you throw at it, this RTX 3070 will be able to handle it all. And don't worry about overheating issues, as the RTX 3070 comes with a built-in WinForce 3X cooling system with alternate spinning fans, allowing for even heat dispersion across the entire build of the GPU, so much to allow for longer play and work times without the worry about it getting melted or broken. So there you have it folks, those are our top 3 picks for the most popular graphics cards that are out there on the market. Which one do you want to go out and grab to take your gaming experience to the next level or make your workspace go a lot smoother? Plus, are there any graphics cards that we missed that you think should have been on the list? Let us know in the comment section down below and if you enjoyed this video, please give us a big thumbs up if you like what we do, plus subscribe to the channel for more amazing reviews and content just like this. Not to mention that if you do want to grab any of the products that we've covered in today's video, you can check them out in the description below if you want to pick them up. And if you're wanting to find out more about amazing product reviews by us, then click on one of these videos here to be able to learn more.